Hi everyone. Okay. So today's topic is what is testing environment, what is production environment, and what is development environment. Okay. And the f- most important question is that why testing environment is similar to the production environment. Okay. Uh, after the requirements have been collected and design of the software has been developed, the CRS is then given to the development team for coding. Okay, understood. And develop and building of the modules and the software. The development team stores all the modules and its code, which it which uh, they build in a development server. Okay, uh, I will show you example. Okay, you can give it any other name. Okay, that is suppose suppose I write here Rex. Okay. See, the developers are developing the software. They uh, they store okay in a development server and in the zip format. Okay, what development lead will do? He will gather all these builds of the developers and he will combine each other, compile, and in the zip format he will send the mail to the testing team. The, what test lead will do? He will take that zip file and then he will unzip that and he will install into the testing server now testing uh, test uh, lead will give all the software all the models each module to the each engineer test engineer, and they will start to testing now they will start on testing the module a or entire module a they will say that it uh, they will require uh, five days to complete their testing on that same time the development Team process will be start for the B module. Until the bug report comes, they will start to develop the program. Now testers will find all the bugs in the module A. They will assign to the test engineer. Now test team, test lead will give the defect report to the development team. And development lead will give all the bug fixing to the prospective developers who were is assigned. Okay. Now this cycle will be continue for A, B, C. This is a development server, testing server. Okay. Now why testing server should be similar to the production server? Okay. Because the you, your requirement should be meet. Your software which is developed should be meet customer's requirement. Okay. So in which three cases testing server should be product uh, should be similar to the production server? First, software should be similar. On the both server, hardware should be similar on both server, okay, and data which is used for the business purpose should be similar on both server. Now, what is the hardware should be similar to the uh, production server which is used in the testing server? That is whatever uh, CPU, whatever HP.